Mm. My brother gave me a piece of linoleum for my math treehouse, and I want to see if it's big enough to cover the bottom. So I need to find the area of my treehouse to see if I have enough linoleum. Well, how do I find the area of a shape like this, since area is length times width? Well, I have to break it up into two different rectangles. And then I calculate the area for each and add them together. I'm going to start with the smaller rectangle. 2 times 3 is 6. And now I'm going to do the larger rectangle. 3 times 6 is 18. 6 plus 18 is 24. The area of my math treehouse is 24 feet squared. Remember, any time you find area, the unit will be squared. To find out if my linoleum is going to fit, I made a scale drawing of my plans for the treehouse. Except for it's in inches instead of feet. So whenever you see a number, it's actually supposed to be in feet. Even though for my drawing, it's just in inches. This piece of construction paper is made to scale of the linoleum that I have. It's 8 inches by 3 inches, which is 24 inches squared. Wow, that's the same area as my treehouse. Now I need to find out what shape I need to cut the linoleum into. I'm going to try to cut 2 inches off of this piece of construction paper. Now I have two pieces, one that is 3 inches by 6 inches, and the other that is 2 inches by 3 inches. So if I lay them down like this, it fits. So that means I need to cut off two feet of linoleum. Then I can make it fit the floor of my treehouse, since they have the same area. Well, it looks like as long as I measure my linoleum correctly, I'll have just enough to fit the bottom of my math treehouse.